Hey guys, so um, this video that um, I'm about to make, uh, the purpose of this video is to show you when you're going to leg lengthening, how, how do you poop and pee? How do you go to the restroom? And I know some of you may find this video or the subject maybe disgusting or repelling and I, you know, viewers discretion is advised. You don't have to watch it. But I feel like before I was going through the leg lengthening before the surgery, had I, had I seen such video, it would have helped me. You know, mainly I wanted to make this video because, you know, I had purchased uh, the toilet riser as well. And it really didn't help me. I didn't even use the toilet riser. I couldn't, you know, to be honest, first two weeks after surgery, I literally could not bend, I could not squat. So I could not really feel comfortable sitting on the toilet seat. So with riser, it would have been the same story. I would still have to sit on the seat even though the only difference would be that it would be higher. So I, I would have appreciated if I would have seen such a video. I just wanna demonstrate for some of you guys who are looking to leg lengthen that at least how did I manage to go to bathroom the first week and a half, first two weeks after the surgery. Um, so here it is. Hey guys, so the first one is P. The P was very simple. So for P, I used to bring my walker. Bring the walker on the toilet like this and I would uh, open the toilet, well, open the toilet for the walker. So the toilet is open, position the walker, come up here uh, closer, and that's how um, I would pee. And then back out, close the toilet, and then flush. Now, pooping. So P was pretty straightforward. Pooping was a different issue. So for pooping, right out of the gate, um, I think the first two weeks after the surgery, I was too afraid to bend. So I could not do this. I was too afraid. And the only thing I could do is bend like a little bit like this at, a, at, at an angle. And you have seen, if you followed my videos, you may have seen that I had bought riser, toilet riser. The toilet riser simply would have raised the toilet like so, but I still would have to squat on it, something I was not willing to do. So I would still have to sit like this. So in reality, uh, first two weeks after the surgery, I literally pooped standing up. So I would come like this, and then I would bend like this, so, and then poop. And then I would have that toilet paper handy. I would even take a shower if I have to, but this is how I poop. And then after two weeks, I was brave enough to start squatting and then start sitting. And then I would always have this walker handy. So I always position the walker and bend and I would use these lower level handles if I have to. But the walker was always here. So this was my pooping story. So I know some people like the riser and it may work for them, but for me, um, the riser, I never used it. It was wasted money. And I basically used the walker for pooping and peeing. So maybe it will help some of you guys. So just an FYI.